Hey guys, what's happening? So, ever since I got back into CB radio, I've always, I've been kind of wondering, how can I get audio from my computer into the CB? Yeah, you know, so if I wanted to play recording, which I don't think you're supposed to, I don't think you're supposed to be able to be able broadcasting, but I'm not sure about the legality of that, but, you know, so in this video I wanted to at least try to experiment and see if I could get um, computer audio <clears throat> from my computer down through my CB and transmit through my CB. Um, and really, this is not really so much, um, yeah, I don't want to be like playing recordings and stuff, but really, it's it's really, I'm trying to get into digital modes. So I want to see if I can send and receive in digital modes. Um, like all this stuff for me is just experimental because I don't really do it. It's, it's, I'm more into the technology than I am actually talking on the radio. So just trying to see if I can figure it out and solve it. But um, so not all radios are actually uh, have this capability, um, you know, directly into the back of the radio. So I'm going to bring up a picture of this present radio here right now. And so take a look at the back of this radio. And <clears throat> there's actually a Vox mic function. And it's 2.5 millimeter, but it's designed to have audio input from a Vox mic. So it'll automatically key up, you know, as soon as it actually detects audio. So, you know, if you have one of these older radios, um, you would need to create a, create like a key or you need to create like an audio function that would go into your mic, mic port that would key the mic up. I mean, you could create a circuit, you know, the same way you do like a keying circuit on an amp, you know, that picks up the, the voltage and basically hits a a transistor and a capacitor but um yeah well i mean this this thing already actually has the function you know but i'm not sure about this alluance i know there's, there's a cw port on the back of this one that maybe i could actually uh it would maybe work for the same same exact thing the cw port like it would it would detect the vox and auto key or whatever so all right so um you know not a lot of computers these days actually have full sound cards like they used to with the full input output so actually, I already had this, and I'll put a link down below what it is, but it's just a USB sound card with a mic and audio. And I'm actually going to need this for digital modes. So in digital modes, you know, you're going to actually uh, capture video or, or capture audio and then send out audio back to the radio. So you're, you're capturing the audio to look for uh, digital modes, and then you're sending it back out to transmit through hopefully the uh, Vox function. But uh, yeah, I've always kind of wondered about this. Let's see if I can do it. So... See if I can get it to work. Um, in this video, I'm, ho I'm hoping not to recreate the 111 guy. <laughs> so, yeah, that guy is so annoying. It just spends his whole day saying 1111. So, this is not, hopefully I'm not going to recreate those type of people. But, all right, let's get started and see if I can figure this out. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, uh, I'll put links down below what these are. Um, but one is actually uh, 3.5 to 2.5, uh, the Vox port, and the other one's a uh, 3.5, 3.5 mono. So they're both mono cables, and I verified. I hooked up a headset to my back of that thing and made sure that was mono. You'll know it's mono because you only have, hear audio coming out of one ear. You know, I'm making another video about <coughs> digital modes, but it doesn't seem like there's a lot of people here in the United States do it. Maybe just legality reasons, but like I guess I don't really know because it's just really an experiment. But it seems like they're really big into it in Europe. Um, all right, so I'm gonna have the. Uh, the uh, 2.5, the audio will go to the uh, speaker out, which is the green, and then the pink is the mic in. That will go to the uh, audio out. All right, so I have this speaker going through this alluance right here. <clears throat> the channel 43, I'm gonna put it in my, probably my dummy load, no one will broadcast this. But, okay, so. AM23, nothing's, nobody's talking on it. So, on my computer, I have the outbound audio going through the speaker, which is that little uh, Vox. It's going to go from the computer, out, audio out, to the Vox. So, I'm just going to do a quick Windows test, and it's going to pick it up on channel 23. And right now, the speaker you hear is uh, under my desk here. So, watch. Hear that? So, it activates. So, I'm hitting the slider, and I don't know if we can get that one frame here. With the radio. All right. Watch. Hear that? All right. 
so as I'm as I'm transmitting, it's activating on, on this machine right here, and it's picking up on that radio as you can see. I think I can get that one frame. Pretty cool. Let me uh, try something else. So if you want to, you want to find an audio program because I want to keep my CB. I want to keep my speakers from my computer separate. But you could actually choose mono here. But I'm actually going to be running this in a program that actually I can control the actual audio output. Hey, take a look. <clears throat> so I got a little sound test thing here. All right. Take a look. I really hope I'm not recreating one 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 guy, but uh, not for me, but just giving other people ideas. But um, all right, so really, originally what I was thinking is I could create like some kind of AI program that could actually <laughs> like pick up people's voices and translate them, and then create like a you know like a response just a, just as a test, just just for fun, you know. Basically, translate incoming audio into text, and then. To create a response via text and have it converted back to audio and transmit it through here. Thought that'd be kind of cool. But, um, alright, hopefully this video helps somebody and hopefully I'm not recreating the 111 guy. Alright, awesome.